the pieces of your paper pattern, it's time to start cutting the fabric. Okay, you're going to lay your fabric out and you want it to be selvages matching and you want the print to be on the inside. So you see, we're looking at the back side of the fabric when we lay this out. Um, a lot of times your fabric may have a, a crease in it from the store. Those are just mechanically rolled onto bolts that way. That doesn't mean it's the center of your fabric. So what you wanna do is take a minute and match your selvages, okay? And if anybody is interested, there's a whole other subculture in this. If you wanna get into it at some point, let me know. But So we're gonna match those edges, the manufactured edges, together. These are not the edges that are surged because those are the edges that we cut, okay? And you're gonna match those two edges up and then sort of push the wrinkles out toward the fold side of your fabric. Okay. And you just want to get that lined up really straight. That means you're cutting, your pieces are all going to be cut <clears throat> um, so that the fabric hangs the right direction. Okay, if you just lay them anywhere and cut them any direction, uh, you're going to have issues with the way your shirt hangs. Okay, um, for every piece of your garment, um, there should be what we call the grain line, okay? So this is this arrow, it's literally labeled grain line, and it has the little arrows on each end. This line should be running parallel to the selvage. How do you know if you have it parallel? Do you just eyeball it? No, you're gonna use a ruler, okay? So if you use the ruler, and you can measure, we're gonna do a layout here in a minute, I just wanna show you about grain line, okay? You can measure over, so I'm measuring from my selvage, and this point is, it's hitting on the seven inches. <laughs> seven inches over from the selvage. So then I can come down to the bottom of my line and swing that pattern left or right, whichever way it needs to go, so that it also hits the seven inches line. Okay, and once you've done that, then the rest of it just make it lay flat. Okay, and now you've laid it out. All right, so Caitlin is now going to lay out the whole rest of it and then we'll talk about cutting.